barbershop conversation guys feel free hit the subscribe button so i had a chance to listen to uh, a couple of videos not in their full extent so i'm not i'm not responding to people individually but i, but I, I just want to give a well-rounded approach as it relates to uh Earl Spence, Terrence what, Crawford. Like what up, T? Hey! Seven and one. Seven and one. Fight date coming soon. Um, there's a couple of things that I don't want to do. I don't want to speak for another man. I appreciate Bomac coming out and saying what he had to say. Much respect. But I don't want Bomac speaking for Terrence Crawford. And like as I always say in this if I have positively or negatively I want to say I love you and or I want to say I have a disagreement either of the way either up and down left right and once we get Terrence Crawford in the front of his message or leading his message we'll have a fight I don't doubt it one bit. I don't know the time frame for it you know what I mean but at the end of the day Earl Spence said something in the beginning and Earl Spence, see, I want, I want that fight, but I want him to clear out PBC side as well. I'm not worried about Keith Thurman's belt. I'll be honest, I'm not worried about. I don't know when the fuck that shit gonna happen. But I'm saying that uh, PBC is pushing Deshaun Porter, Earl Spence. I know that for sure, one thousand percent. And. Uh, but I need Terrence Crawford to start speaking. Womack has done a great job. He's been on trail about the talk, talking that shit. But I agree with him or disagree with him. He's done his part. He's done his part in terms of speaking for Terrence Crawford. The same thing, the same way we wanted Sean Porter to say Earl Smith's name after uh, Danny Garcia victory. It's the same thing we want from uh, uh, Terrence Crawford. Once Terrence Crawford starts speaking, we, we got to fight because at the end of the day, this fight only makes boxing better. When I say better, I mean, oh my God, I don't man. Earl Spence ain't no punk. Terrence Crawford, ain't no punk. we know this. But now it's time for each of them to get in front of their message. Terrence Crawford has yet to speak out and be very concise and quick. That's all I'm asking for. He can pick his favorite social. He can pick his favorite media guy. I don't care who it is, whether it's Ellie, Fight Height, someone from LDBC, New Media, Ego, or a channel I don't even know of. ESPN. I don't care. I'm being real. I, like I say, I always say, my job is to build the profile of these fighters. And when we build the profile of these fighters, they deserve to get paid handsome for what they do. So, at the end of the day, I want this fight to happen. But it, it can't happen if we have someone else speaking for the main guy. Terrence Crawford got to use the social media because, real talk, Terrence Crawford is the responder. He's not taking initiative and leading leading the uh, leading the conversation. I genuinely believe, like I said in the video just passed, this is that's their legacy fight. You know, Hearns, Hagler, Leonard, Graham, you know, the four horsemen of the 80s. We all know that. But I want Terrence Crawford to speak for himself. Errol Spence has spoken for himself. And uh, from what I know about Earl Spence, he's the kind of guy that says he wants. You know what I mean? And I don't mean it once as I mean like like, like says it once with conviction and then we'll just have a conversation about it thereafter. You understand? And the same way the entire welterweight division was watching Danny Garcia, Sean Porter, I thought Terrence Crawford should have been there. I genuinely thought Terrence Crawford should have been there. Uh, he wasn't there. Uh, uh, Terrence Crawford has a fight next week. I would have him favor. I'm gonna bet some. I'm betting money on Terrence Crawford this week. I'm gonna. I'm gonna wait for the odds to get as close as they can, and I'm gonna bet. I'm gonna make some money on Terrence Crawford next week. So at the end of the day, Terrence Crawford, speak for yourself. And I think everything else is clear. I'm gonna finish watching you guys' videos. I didn't get a chance to finish watching because I'm listening to music, listening to videos. I'm in between rounds. I'm trying to get hype. I'm trying to keep my energy consistent. Trying to elevate my energy. So. Uh, but I'm done now, so I'm about to start my day. And uh, but I salute both them kings, but like for real, for real, it's it's genuinely nothing but love. 
and I'll say this to LDBC, New Media, and everyone else I align myself with, that's our fight. And I want everyone to fully grasp that concept. I don't mean it's only the fighters. I mean it's the narrative, the energy of the fight. That's our fight, and we should own it. And uh, Terrence Crawford and Earl Spence need to respect us and treat us accordingly, which Earl Spence is always respectful of that. Always, I, I do 20 minute interviews with Earl Spence. You understand? And uh, Earl, Terrence Crawford got to start doing the same. And once this start happens, I'm telling you, it starts to fall and we start to get a clear view of what the hell is happening. But until Terrence Crawford, see, until, I can't speak, I don't want to speak for another man. I really, really don't want to speak for another man. And when I do, you know, bad things happen. Like I was pushing a fight last night. That was on my head, right? I was speaking to Sean and Kenny and let that go. I, I, I was promoting the fight. I didn't mean half the shit I said, but it still left some residue with y'all. So I, I'll say this. Terrence Crawford is unafraid of Earl Spence. Earl Spence is unafraid of Terrence Crawford. Let's see if these motherfuckers start talking. Once these motherfuckers start talking, then they start talking. But I know Earl Spence is fighting three times next year. That's the plan for him to fight three times next year. And uh, minimum. That, that's, that's what I heard. He's going to fight three times. And uh, so we'll see. So, anyways, man, barbershop conversation, man. Feel free to hit the subscribe button. I didn't finish the video, so I, so I can't respond to any one person. I heard one minute of one video. One minute of the next video in between rounds, so it's more like 45 seconds. So, man, let's push the shit out of this fight. Man. It's all fight. Barbershop conversation. I'm going.